Good morning. Welcome to LA First Filipino Church of the Nazarene. This is your Nourish My Soul, your online devotion. We're your Los Angeles First Filipino Church of the Nazarene. Please visit our church every Sunday, 9 a.m. Let's start with the reading of the word. Today is February 11, 2021. It's, it's Tuesday. In Mark 5, 36, when Jesus overheard what was said, he told the synagogue leader, don't be afraid, only believe. In Matthew 14, Verses 28 to 33, it says, Lord, if it's you, Peter answered, Command me to come to you on the water. He said, Come. And climbing out of the boat, Peter started walking on the water and came toward Jesus. But when he saw the strength of the wind, he was afraid. And beginning to sink, he cried out, Lord, save me. Immediately, Jesus reached out his hand, caught hold of him, and said to him, You of little faith, why did you doubt? When they got into the boat, the wind ceased. And those in the boat worshipped him and said, Truly, you are the Son of God. Don't be afraid. Jesus knows that we struggle with fears and worries and anxiousness, especially today, during this pandemic COVID-19 problem. He knows our hearts. He knows we are frail humans, often subject to our own rogue emotions and to circumstances beyond our control. He understands when our overstimulated brains won't shut down, especially at night. He perceives when our minds rotate and and an upsetting incident over and over. Paulit, ulit mong iniisip minsan ng mga bagay-bagay. He knows that fear and anxiety crash in our faith, making it hard to believe Him. When the Apostle Peter dared to step out of the boat, he began to sink because he feared the waves. Aren't we the same? We attempt to be brave and then surges off angst, knocks us off balance and then we sink. And yet, with deliberate brevity, Jesus gives us two simple instructions. Don't be afraid. Just believe. This is exactly what our anxious hearts need to hear. The Lord invites us to resist fear and believe Him over all the anxiety producing events we're experiencing. It's an irresistible invitation that lovingly reminds us who He is. He is our unwavering water walking help. And He is right there in the wind and waves with us. Jesus is our Prince of Peace. He beacons us to leave fear behind and trust Him. 
choosing to say in faith, Lord, I will not be afraid. I will believe. Don't be afraid. Just believe. Let us pray. Lord, when we fear and anxiety crash into my faith and I'm afraid, help me to trust you and follow your two simple instructions. Don't be afraid. Just believe. Teach me, Lord, to remember you. To remember that you are greater than all my fears. Thank you that my emotions go crazy. You are the stabilizing force right beside me. Greater than every storm and you are, you are good. I believe, Jesus, that you are greater than all the uh, upheaval in my heart. I believe that you are able to deal with all that concerns me. I believe that you are the Prince of Peace. Thank you for calming my heart and helping me to always accept your loving invitation. Help, help me not to be afraid, Lord but to believe. Lord Jesus, I repent of my sins. I ask for your forgiveness. I am a sinner, but I believe that you died upon the cross for me, that you shed your precious blood for the forgiveness of my sins. I accept you now as my Savior, my Lord, my God, my friend. Come into my heart and set me free from my sin. Thank you, Lord. In Jesus' mighty name. Amen and amen. The Lord bless you and keep you. The Lord make his face shine upon you and be gracious to you. The Lord turn his face toward you and give you peace. In the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. And amen. This is your Nourish My Soul. It's Tuesday morning. God bless you. We'll see you tomorrow. Friday Life Group. Bye.